Hey what's up YouTube, I'm back again with another jailbreak update video. In today's video I'll be talking about the new jailbreak has been just released for the iOS 11.x up to iOS 11.3.1. Also it will be work for iOS 11.4 beta 1 up to beta 3. Before I'm gonna be start today's video, I will ask you guys to give the video a huge thumbs up and also make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you will be notified always about any kind of jailbreak update videos. Hey welcome back guys, so a new jailbreak has been just got released from another developer and that jailbreak is only for the iOS 11.x up to iOS 11.3.1 also it will be work for the iOS 11.4 beta 1 up to beta 3. It's kind of like the same thing just like the Electra but it's gonna be more faster and there is a lot of additional stuff add to that jailbreak. So if you want to ask me I already jailbreak with Electra and what is the difference in between both. This one here which is the Uncover this is for the name for that jailbreak it's much faster at the same time the CD is gonna be faster you will be received no issue you will be received nothing like the Electra and then I'm about to show you guys right now how you can get the IPA file how you can set up that I'm gonna be use that on my device here to show you guys how is that will be work but first of all this is the uh, home page here which is I will leave for you guys in the description down below if you want to get the IPA file so you can see right now here this is the most outstanding change over the other jailbreak so here you can read a pretty much and a lot of different kind of stuff this is a ton different kind of stuff you can go through here it was actually explained for you most of the things and what is the different uh, the uncover where is the different than the other jailbreak so this is the pretty much a lot of things as I told you guys here you can go through you can read it so once you want right now to download the IPA file go ahead and just navigate all the way to the bottom and by the way before I'm gonna be showing you guys the uh, the IPA or where you can get the IPA from Sorik is actually he knows about that jailbreak and has got being approved from Sorik so let me just go ahead right now to show you guys where you can get the IPA file from so you can get the uh, this is like a few hours ago I already see the RC1 and we are right now currently in RC4 so uh, anyway if you want to get the last update which is the RC4 go ahead and just download the IPA go ahead and just click here once you click here you will be see the file automatically start being downloading Anyway, so after you done from the downloading, just go ahead right now and launch your CDM Pactor. If you don't know about the CDM Pactor, I will be leave the link in the description down below. It will be work for the both operating system, the Windows and the Mac operating system. Go ahead and download the last update for the CDM Pactor. Once, uh, as soon as you have your IPF file, it's ready here. Just go ahead and connect your device and go ahead and drag and drop that file on your iDevice. Anyway, let me jump right now on my iDevice to show you guys how you can navigate everything from the iPhone. So as I show you guys, once you finish uh, downloading the IPA file in your iDevice, you will be uh, see the icon for the Uncover jailbreak. Uh, if you want to launch the app, it wasn't work. So all what you need to do, just go ahead on the, the settings. Uh, from the settings, you need to go to general. And then from general, you need to go all the way to the profiles and device management. Just go ahead and accept the certificate for that file and then if you go ahead right now back you can launch the uncover jailbreak so anyway let me just go ahead right now and jump on the app launch the app and you can see right now you can just go ahead and jailbreak your device before that you can take a look here in the bottom we have jailbreak and we have the settings if we go ahead and tap on the settings there is a lot of options you can go through one of the options uh, the load tweaks you can toggle that make sure you toggle that always 
and then the other stuff which is I really like it disable the auto update so once you receive any update from Apple uh, that disable auto update it will be disable everything the other disable app revokes it is available so you can toggle that as well also the other option which is going to be the expiry so you can check on your certificate always using the jailbreak app which is really beautiful and nice this is really useful it's better than you go inside Cedia to download one of the tweaks to check always on your expiry date you need to keep in mind if you want to jailbreak with uncovered you don't need to do anything like recover or restore you don't need to care about your sources your, the tweaks that you already download using the Electra the only thing that you need to do in order to jailbreak with uncover just delete the old Electra application once you get the uncover all what you need to do just go ahead and hit the jailbreak and the uncover will be organize everything for you so let me go ahead right now and tap on the jailbreak I will be get back to you guys alright so after a few uh, times uh, I tried to hit the jailbreak it is actually right now working it takes like a few times to jailbreak my device and once I launch Cydia, Cydia it's much faster I can tell and then also it's much stable so I think this is will be much better than the Electra I don't know but you guys let me know in the comment section below if you already want to replace the Electra with Un cover jailbreak and see what is the difference in between the both and then you can see right now the most sources on my iDevice the tweaks that I already download everything still have it on Cydia so I just replaced the app I already delete the Electra and I download the uncover right now and this is how it's gonna be work anyway so this is the uncovered jailbreak if you want to replace your Electra with uncovered jailbreak as I told you before this is will be for the iOS 11.0 up to iOS 11.3.1 also it will be work for the iOS 11.4 beta 1 up to beta 3 another thing that I want to mention about it if you are looking for one year certificate for the uncovered jailbreak it is available right now if you want to go ahead using your iDevice and uh, you can use the ignition website you can find the one year certificate for the uncovered jailbreak it is available right now you can do that right away you don't need to use a computer or CDM factor all what you need to do using your iDevice and you can jailbreak with uncover so that's it for today's video I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and don't forget again make sure to give the video a huge thumbs up and also make a short subscribe and hit that notification bell so you will be notified always about new videos catch you with the next one peace